Hi guys, this will be attempt number three at a balloon powered helicopter. Same principle as before, got some polystyrene or styrofoam plates, got some drinking straws that have got the flexible bit on them, and this time I've got a old felt tip pen because I've check the top and it's just about the right size for a balloon to go on so I'll drill four holes in that stick the drinking straws in there either hot glue or super glue whichever seems to grip it best and this time I'm going to cut individual blades out of the styrofoam and attach them to the side of the straw so we get us a better aerodynamic shape. Maybe. We'll see. Not sure which would be lightest, tape or glue. No point in using super glue because that dissolves this styrofoam. Yeah, that's dissolving. So we won't be using super glue. So it's either sticky tape. four blades. Now we'll make four holes in this pen top and glue them in place. Well, there we go. I ended up using an electric drill rather than my soldering iron because it makes a neater hole. Let's turn my valve. There we go. So I'll now glue them in place. I'll have to hot glue them. That's the only thing I can think of using tilted them all down slightly to give us a lifting motion as they spin round. Wind's gusting around a little bit in my garden, but we'll go and give it a test flight. Come back indoors because that's just too windy out there. Just going to try a different balloon as well because the last one popped surprisingly enough. I do believe there was a split second of rising flight then. Smaller, lighter balloon again. Uh, 
and again. Well, we're definitely getting a little bit of a hover and a different shaped balloon. Another fresh, small balloon. And again. Did that go up a bit then? Try that bigger balloon again. Small balloon again. We're definitely getting one or two rotations that either lift slightly or at least maintain their height. So that's significantly better than attempt one and attempt two. We're much closer, but still not a real success. This is one of the suggestions I received. Try a balloon inside a balloon. So you've got double the thickness, so double the pressure. Well, that looked quite positive. We'll try that again. This was Amir Alamir's suggestion. Balloon inside another balloon. It's much too strong for me to blow up with my own lungs. I'm having to use a pump to pump it up. Definite rising flight. Thank you, Amir. One last go, I think, because I'm enjoying this, with two more balloons, one inside the other. Brilliant. Summary time. We actually had an element of success there. So that's third attempt and some success. We're still not flying away into the distance, but we've definitely got rising flight there. And what did it was two balloons, one inside the other, to give us extra pressure, to give us the extra thrust. The actual build, the drinking straws taped to the polystyrene or styrofoam blades, that was just one a hover suggested that. I even went to the extent of slightly sanding down the blades to make them thinner at the back and more flexible. As you can see they've got quite a curve on them now. Um, the centerpiece was part of a felt tip pen. It was actually the bottom of the felt tip pen. Just happens to be the right size for the balloons to go on to. I really don't feel like doing another one of these, so if anybody else wants to have another go, feel free and show me how to do it. But I thought I'd have one more go after attempts one and two were real failures. Attempt three, marginal success. Down to Amir Alamir and the two balloons idea. Thank you.